My fellow colleagues, today it is my pleasure to present to you with my video entry going by the title Beyond Reality Using Holograms and Dynamic Navigation in Implant Surgery. My name is Mark Matula and I'm going to share with you some patient cases we've done by using these tools. The objectives of the procedure include predictable implant position through digital backwards planning and the use of dynamic navigation supported by augmented reality. The possibility to engage in a patient case via backwards planning, meaning to start with the placement of a crown and going from there to the placement of the implant itself, is what drives my daily work ethics. To have interdisciplinary meetings between the surgeon in charge and me as a prosthodontist means to have a much better understanding on how to operate successfully on a patient. Guided implant placement is a standard procedure since 20 years especially in a delayed approach in the upper front. Many thousands of implantations done this way showed that this treatment has limits. So the next logical step was real-time navigation. But here as well, I was not fully satisfied as it to me seems problematic that my focus is on the screen and no longer on my patient. The HoloLens gives me the opportunity to concentrate on the patients and having all the important and useful informations projected in the field of vision above the mouth of the patient. The Microsoft HoloLens is one of many mixed reality devices which combines the real world with a digital information level. The user can interact and control holograms which connect the real world to the digital world and enhances it therefore. What are the possibilities? During planning and surgery, holograms can give the dentist additional information. For example, the patient's history, models of the jaw, radiographs and implant planning can be seen through the smart glass directly above or beside the patient while in surgery. The surgeon can always interact with those holograms and even stay completely sterile while doing so using voice comments and gesture control. Our first case is a 58-year-old woman who has lost her second upper premolar due to an infection. The buccal lamella was non-existent anymore and the situation called for socket preservation. After the healing of the socket graft, you can see me planning the case via backwards planning from the crown to the implant. During the whole procedure, the surgeon sees the dynamic navigation, the CBCT and other important information directly above the patient's mouth. Via dynamic navigation with support of mixed reality, the implant was placed and finally fixed with a torque of 60 Newton centimeters. 